This video is going to show how to pair an iPad to a BrailleSense U2. The first thing you want to do is turn that BrailleSense on by using the slider in the front of the, the BrailleSense. Once you slide it, you'll hear power on. The BrailleSense has four function keys in the front of the BrailleSense. You've got F1, F2, Spacebar, F3, and F4. You'll hit F1. You're going to go down to Utilities. Hit Enter. We're going to go down to Terminal for Screen Reader. On Bluetooth, you hit Bluetooth. And now it says Terminal Mode, so we're done with the Braille Sense for now. Then you're going to go to your iPad. A lot of our iPads are protected with a code. Once you get into it, you're going to hit the settings button. And it will more than likely be on the general page. Go down to accessibility. And on accessibility, you want to go down first and make sure your accessibility shortcut is selected to voiceover. Uh, that'll just save you and your students time in the long run. Then you go back to settings. We're going to go to access when and under accessibility we have voiceover. Tap and turn voiceover on. We're going to go down to Braille. Double tap. We're going to scroll down. Find Braille use Braille Sense U2176, and I'll tap it. How I know that was my Braille Sense was I had the same number. Of Braille Sense on my case. These are all four zeros. Now it is time sensitive, so make sure if you don't hit those zeros in uh, quick enough, sometimes it says it failed. You just want to make sure you are aware of that. And then you're tight. You're scrolling. You are attached to your iPad and your Braille display. That's all there is to it. If you have any questions or concerns about pairing your iPad to the Braille Sense to use as a Braille display, don't hesitate to contact the Library Media Center or the Braille Resource Department. Thanks.